If you have a Mac and you use a bunch of applications, that menu bar on the top right might look a little, uh, it gets messy and it's kind of annoying. But luckily I came across a solution, it's completely free and it can turn this nastiness into something maybe your mom might even say, good job son, good job Mike. Yeah, and so in this video I want to show you the app, it's called Vanilla. I'll just run you through how to set it up and how you can use it for you. All right, so here's the website of the app Vanilla. I'll leave the URL in the video description, but it's pretty cool. You can see it's by uh, it's on MatthewPalmer.net. So it's a personal project uh, by a developer, I'm assuming. So very cool. Thank you for this, and uh, let's go ahead and download it for free, baby. So we want to download this. So we're just going to drag this into the applications. But since I already have it, that's why I get this message. So once you have the app, you just want to open it. So I'll just do the shortcut here and open it. So once you have the app open, it's really simple to use. Uh, basically, you have sort of these sections uh, that are divided by these dots. And what the dot is saying is that anything to the right of it will remain visible and then the stuff on the left will be hidden and then there's this third option about removed uh, but that's a that's a pro that's for the pro version uh, so just to show you how it works really is you have this little uh, arrow here and if you just click it you can make things disappear and so you can see I've removed a ton of, of, of the little icons which is great even the time so if I don't want to look at the time if I just want to you know get lost in time then I can uh, just move it to the left, but by pressing the Apple key Then I can just drag it to the right side of it and Then now you can see it's uh, it's showing it's always showing so What's really nice is that you can get rid of these uh, You know have it really minimal and that's uh, super nice. I just find it super clean. It's, it's really helpful uh, just to go back on the this remove section there that is possible uh, for a pro version, but to be honest I haven't I, I didn't think to, to upgrade for that reason. But what is nice is that the upgrade version does have this start vanilla when I log in. So every time you log in, uh, let's say you shut down your computer, you will have to make sure to turn this back on. And so it could be nice just to have this. And I think um, I think you pay like five bucks for it. I think that's the current price. So anyway, um, that's, the, uh, that's the app in a nutshell. And it turns this nastiness into, uh, yeah, really uh, more minimal. It's really nice. Hopefully this was helpful for you. I know for myself when I'm building websites and doing a lot of designs and stuff, you just have you you're using a lot of applications and so this menu bar just fills up and it just, you know, when you're on your MacBook Pro or something, it just kind of feels messy. It just feels like why do I have to look at all these things when I'm trying to have a minimal or, or clean desktop. So anyway, this was an awesome solution and you know props to the developer of this. His name is uh, Matthew Palmer, thanks so much for building this. I don't know why Apple hasn't contacted you and said, okay, let's buy this from you and just integrate this because everyone can benefit from this. So uh, hope, I hope Apple buys this from you. They should. They really should. And thanks to you for watching this video. Hopefully you got something out of it. Let me know by giving it a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see more tips like this, please consider subscribing to my channel where I'm going to be posting more videos about how to more effectively uh, manage your softwares so you can do things a little bit faster, as well as websites, how to get more value out of them. All right? Thanks, and have a great day.